led the nation with the number of drug overdose deaths, but this year the state's national ranking has improved significantly. We ask New Mexico's epidemiologist about why this is so in tonight's State of Addiction. State epidemiologist Michael Landon expects New Mexico to rank 15th in the nation for drug overdose deaths. It will change most likely. But it looks like we have a significant drop in our overdose death rate. That's projected from preliminary data gathered in 2016. Compare that from decades ago when New Mexico scored far worse. New Mexico first led the nation in 1992 with respect to drug overdose death. So if we're able to get somewhere between, you know, closer to 15th ranking, that's a huge, that's a huge victory. But Landon says while New Mexico's drug-related death rates have stayed relatively static in recent years, other states have struggled more than ever. A lot of the drug overdose death rates on the East Coast, particularly because of fentanyl uh, drug overdose death, are, are increasing substantially. Landon explains it's likely because fentanyl has been distributed more in the East, but that doesn't mean it won't become a problem here. And we're, we're very vigilant because fentanyl is a very dangerous drug and we don't want to see it uh, showing up on the streets.